we're going to do the area of a triangle based on the three side lengths of that triangle. So we're not given any information about the angles. This comes from a question I was asked on Discord with the three side lengths being 35 millimeters, 54, and 61. Those are all the same unit, which is ideal. We're going to use something called Heron's formula, the square root of S times S minus A times S minus B times S minus C. A, B, and C are the three side lengths, and S is called the semi-perimeter. It is the perimeter, A plus B plus C, but divided by two, so it's half of the total perimeter. Let's just jump straight into the formula here. To calculate the semi-perimeter, you add up the three side lengths, that's 35 millimeters plus 54 millimeters plus 61 millimeters, and then we're going to divide by two. I'm going to use a calculator to do all this. 35 plus 54 plus 61 gives me 150. Then when I divide by 2, I get 75. So the semi-perimeter here is 75 millimeters. Now we're going to use that in Heron's formula. Here, I have 75 millimeters for my S. S minus A is going to be that 75 less whatever side length A is. And it doesn't matter what order you put these in, any of them can be A or B or C, just make sure you use each one once and not you know, one of them twice or something, right? 75 minus 35 is 40. That difference is in millimeters. 75 minus 54, you know what, I'm just gonna check that on the calculator, turns out to be 21 millimeters. 75 minus 61 is 14 millimeters. Again, 75 minus 35, 75 minus 54, 75 minus 61. Now I'm going to multiply all the things that are together under the square root. 75 times 40 times 21 times 14. That gives me 3 zero, three, five. And if you want to write units here, this is in millimeters to the power of four. One, two, three, four of those units all multiplied together does give you an exponent of four. But then when you square root it, it's going to cut that unit down to millimeters squared, which is exactly what you expect for the units of an area to be, some unit of distance, but squared. I also have to square root 30, 35 here. I'm going to take the square root of that answer. I get 55.09. Cool. There you go. The area of this triangle is 55 millimeters squared-ish, and you used Heron's formula to get it. Did it feel complicated because you needed to calculate the semi-perimeter ahead of time and then do all of these subtractions? Maybe, but don't worry. You can do it. I believe in you. Best of luck.